Control structures provide an ideal access port to sample both the tile drainage water flowing into the bioreactor and the tile drainage water flowing out of the bioreactor. In the process of grab sampling, we use a bottle on a stick to collect a water sample. Make sure the bottle is clean and secure. Stick it down to the water and rinse the bottle three times. This ensures that the water being collected is truly representative of what is flowing through that control structure. Pour the fourth filling of the bottle into your pre-labeled sample collection bottle, checking the label first carefully. We recommend that the bottles are pre-labeled because that minimizes the possibility of mixed up samples in the field. Cap the bottle tightly, again verifying the label. Close the control structure lid and secure it. Put the sample on ice for transport and keep it frozen until it can be thawed for analysis at the laboratory. It's essential to keep the samples very cold so that bacteria naturally present in the water don't change the forms of nitrogen in the water before it's analyzed. In terms of where to actually collect the water sample, we suggest collecting the water as it's flowing over the top of the stop logs rather than collecting the sample from the standing water behind the stop logs. But if there's no flowing water over the stop logs in the control structure, it's okay to collect the sample from the standing pool. And don't forget, you need to sample both the inflow and the outflow structures.